Hello, welcome back everybody. We're looking at Duran Roth map. Um, it's a pretty cool looking map from what I've seen thus far. So, basically it's got a lot of small fields. It was uploaded by a bot, but I took a little capture of the, uh, the credits portion. They do name uh, quite a few people in here that I know of that's kind of big name. They think uh, giants, but I mean, giants didn't personally help them. But this guy's Shy Wizard. A lot of people use the Shy Wizard to learn how to build maps. Swiss Farmer, Lancy Boy, I've heard of him. RD Modding, Black Sheep Modding, NKB Modding. So there's a few of them on here I know of. FSUK, I didn't think they had a website no more. But here it is transferred over in English. That's why you see LS. It was in German, I think it was. I'll let you start and pause or whatever to read this. I'm going to fire my intro up. It is a little bit longer than it was. It's a two minute if you want to skip. I added a couple funny things to it. To, so if you've already seen it, you, if you want to check out the um, addition to it, uh, I threw in a couple of things in there. If not, skip two minutes. Yeah, he does pretty good. He actually can beat me at this game. So, yes, him throwing him. He's playing his sister right now, so. Oh, she quit. She can see it. it turn too much, it turns fast. The reason I'm not going to be happy is because you're not going to be happy once I beat you. Hope you like the new intro i thought i had a couple more to it so if you don't want to see it, if you already seen it skip two minutes each time but it will be coming up we are streaming this on twitch to record it for youtube uh, as you can see we got chat going and if you want to comment and just not look at the maps and voice your opinions so if you're a modder or map reviewer or whatever and you want to take part and have some fun look at some maps Come in and join. So that's the channel. So whenever you come in, this is your view. You don't start off on the farm. That is your pickup sitting in the middle of town. You start off in the center of town right here. Here's where actually the house and stuff goes, but the house is missing. Or at least it seems to be. So future update. It was uploaded by a bot, like I said, so it might not have just been completely finished yet. And as you see, there's a ton of sale points on this map, a ton. So you're going to get great competitive pricing. You're not going to have far to drive uh, to sell your products. So small farming, <coughs> all small farming. I love small farming. So, hey, I'm thinking about playing some on this map. But I'm going to do a mud runner again tonight. 
because I'm Gary for Snow Runner. But anyway, this is the land you own. You own nearly half the map. Um, you do, like I said, if you want a house, you're going to have to buy one. You can get them pretty cheap. They have them on modhub.us. Just look for a house and then look for a slate trigger or just throw down a house you want. Uh, these lands can be sold and get down to just one or two. I actually like to try to buy and earn my stuff. And if you do old iron game and play like I do, nothing really costs anything. So, you know, you're able to um, get some equipment really cheap and everything else. You really don't need a lot of money anyway. As you can see, you can buy the, uh, the forest areas and stuff in this map. Several grass areas. As far as your garage goes, you got all kinds of storage. You got several tractors, four, combine, pickup truck, that's right here in front of us, the blue one. You got your trailers, you got everything you possibly could ever need. Like I said, you're gonna have so much land and so much uh, money if you sell it, or there, unless you just got a personal preference on what it is that you wanna use, you got a ton of stuff so there won't be no money issues on this map you just kind of take your time farming what you want and just play relax and stuff like that so we'll start off fly I flew. I'm actually over at that section I was talking about you can see where all the equipment is you can tell it looks like a house belongs there I currently don't have enough money to buy a house unless I sell the property but then if I did that I would be able to um, put out a house, has a nice little driveway and stuff, plenty of area for you to put your stuff in. Your traffic is on the right side of the road if you're American, the wrong side if you're English. So you got um, plenty of stuff down through here. You got a nice barbed wire fence. The fields and the hills and everything is not flat. It looks nice. I've looked at this map a couple times thus far Everything looks really nice and well done. Even the ditches and stuff. Your clutter. I have nothing. I have seen anything wrong with this uh, map thus far, and it's supposed to be air free. And I know for a fact that it has people. Like I said, I mean, it has a very natural feel to it. Plenty of shrubs, trees, flowers, traffic, people. And I mean, it looks really natural. Everything about this map thus far looks really natural to me. So, right off the bat, I'm kind of liking this map. It is uh, the style I usually like to play. I usually like doing um, small farming to medium. I don't mind doing large. This is the end of the map. But in saying that, it's really not. It is a map within a map. Don't know if you can come on out here and mess around, but the way that they've done it and everything, there's no cardboard borders. Uh, the trees and everything looks nice. So when you're down here and you're farming and you look at your backdrop on the sides, it's very nice. So for what they've done in the area that they've done it in, I'm, like I said, I'm really liking it a lot. little BGA little meaning big um, all your fields a lot of your fields is unusually shaped but I mean if you like odd shaped fields maybe a little bit of trimming out nice looking old areas and stuff to a map give it a check I mean it's really not a large uh, download at all I think it's around three or four hundred megs like I said tons of cell points I mean tons they're, they're everywhere all over this map they're easy to get into I don't think you're gonna have any trouble at all uh, with this map as far as you know um, getting around now this bridge here would be a little tight but I mean it's small farming there's no use of getting 
a great big giant tractor and combine stuff on here. I got a little walkway up here for the people to walk around through this forest slash woods. That's the first person I've seen kind of levitating. But like I said, I haven't seen uh, really thus far any trees floating or people floating. Everything kind of has a very natural setting. So, that's kind of the gist of the map. Uh, so, great job. I like it. I don't think you're going to go wrong trying it. Looks like uh, some of the fields can be combined if you're actually wanting to um, go bigger. Kind of like this one here. And that was kind of got a really funky layout. But, I mean, you can combine this and these. So, if it's too small and you eventually want to grow, as long as you get across the bridges and stuff, you should be okay for some areas of it. So, with that, um, in case you don't know and you haven't ever heard of Farming Simulator, here you go. Jump on over to their website and um, check out the mods. You got your different systems and stuff here. You got a little bit of everything here. And like I said, I do do a lot of stuff. So click on one of these videos and um, find something that appeals to you and tickle death that you came by. So with that, take care and have fun, everybody.